I'm Tom Wiltz with uh, Guard Lee Incorporated. Uh, we are here at the Pima Air and Space Museum in Tucson, Arizona. Uh, and we're, we're so pleased to be here working with the museum on the exhibit that you see behind me. Uh, Guard Lee Incorporated is a maker of full-scale uh, space and aerospace replicas. And again, we were delighted to be able to make a replica X-15 for uh, Pima Air and Space, uh, specifically for their NB-52 uh, jet, the original jet that launched the actual X-15s in the er late 50s, early 60s uh, yeah, from Edwards Air Force Base. Uh, the background on that program is uh, uh, three X-15s were built. Uh, they were flown uh, almost 200 flights, I believe. Uh, and they were launched from one of two B B-52s during the program. The one you see behind me is one of those two. Pima Air and Space restored this B-52 over a number of years. And over approximately that same time, Guard Lee Incorporated was commissioned to build a replica X-15 that would fit onto the B-52's pylon. So, uh, you know, extensive measurements were made originally where we determined uh, how to attach the replica uh, to the same pylon that was used in the late 50s, early 60s. And then the designs grew up from that. So our replica is primarily aluminum and fiberglass. Uh, it's, uh, of course, painted in uh, the uh, original colors uh, with the uh, copying stencils of a uh, specific flight. And we specifically copied the vehicle 66670 uh, at the request of the museum. So. Uh, that's where all of the, the details and the general look of the piece come. Uh, the rest was uh, getting it over road, getting it out here and working with the uh, museum staff to put it up. Uh, th this should be, I think, a, a really wonderful addition to, uh, uh, to the museum. Uh, the, the, as far as the artifacts go, uh, one artifact is at Wright-Patterson Air Force Base that was actually flown in the program. Uh, the other vehicle that survived the program is in the National Air and Space Museum. Uh, the third vehicle, unfortunately, was lost. There was a crash that occurred, um, and unfortunately, we lost one of the pilots during the program. Uh, but two do survive, and again, they are in uh, museums. Uh, this replica on the B-52, I think, will be a singular unique exhibit because there are other X-15 replicas around the country. There are a few others, but this one united to the NB-52 will tell a unique part of the story of that program uh, and, and again help preserve that legacy, uh, especially on the Artifact B-52. So again, we're, we're very pleased to be able to be a part of this and um, uh, it will be a stunning exhibit to be seen at the museum.